Many people closely watch what they eat. They might try to avoid sugars or fats. Or they might want some extra fiber or protein. WCCO viewer Minnie Jax does. She tweeted us wanting to know how nutrition labels are measured. So how do scientists know what's in our food? Good question. Heather Brown went to the lab to find out. Sometimes it looks like a bakery here. We have all sorts of different kind of pies and uh, meat. Inside the MVTL laboratories in New York. The first step is grinding. This afternoon, it was dried carrots. What's the weirdest thing you've had to grind? I had a very thick, moist fruitcake once <laughs> that was quite challenging. <laughs> they then take that powder and portion it out into several samples. There's about 15 different tests done on it. Dan O'Connell is the chemistry lab manager. So there's a lot of science that goes into this. Yes, there is. Yes. <laughs> a, lot of, a lot of skill and a lot of technical time. The FDA requires 15 measurements for most foods, from sugars to vitamins to fiber to fats. They walked us through measuring sugars once the food is ground up. So right now, I'm going to measure 15 milliliters of acetyl nitrile and 30 mils of water. That mixture is then filtered into a water chemical sugar mix and sent through this CSI looking like machine. That's a, basically a separation mm -hmm. um, with an analytical column that'll separate out the five different sugars. Those sugars are then compared to a known amount of sugar to get the final measurement. Is it a similar process for fats or fiber? Yes, it's similar. Yep, everything everything we need to do is to get a certain, you know, whether it's cholesterol or sugars out of a product mm -hmm. and get it measured. So this isn't the only way to figure out fats and sugars and fiber. Correct. There's also an FDA approved database that has already measured many kinds of foods and ingredients. So if you know there's this much sugar in your food and this much flour and this many eggs, you can just look it up on the database. Yes. Most companies use both methods. So when you go to the store, do you check out nutritional labels? Yes. At the Brown. <laughs> You're not sick I of do. it by the end of the day? No, I do. I look at the label. WCCO 4 News. What an involved process. Uh, the FDA does not require food companies to submit their labels. But it will do spot checks or tests if there are consumer complaints. If you have a good question for Heather, share it with her tonight on Facebook or Twitter.